Hey, what is up everybody? It is AJ here and in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to install Microsoft Teams on your Mac. Of course, if you do like this video, let me know by giving it a thumbs up and if you want to supercharge the ways your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. With that being said, let's get into this. So what we're going to do is jump on the internet and just simply type in download Microsoft Teams and then go to the address that says Microsoft.com, download Microsoft Teams desktop and mobile app. We're going to select on this one here. This will open up a new window and you see in the window it will say download Microsoft Teams and it will give you two options, one for your desktop, one for your mobile. We're going to select on download for desktop, it's going to scroll down the page here and it's going to know we're on an Apple because it's going to give us the Apple logo. Then it's going to say download Teams on your desktop, we're simply going to select on download Teams. This is going to open up a new window when it starts downloading that Teams installation file. It's a small file, should it only take a few seconds to download onto your computer. Once it's done downloading, you can select an open file from here, or if you forgot where it's saved, go into your taskbar down the bottom and go into your downloads folder, and you see teams underscore osx dot pkg, and simply open up this. This is gonna open the Microsoft Teams installer, and it's a couple of steps from here to install Microsoft Teams on your Mac. We're simply gonna select on next, or continue, it's gonna ask us where we wanna install the drive and if we wanna install it for all users. I'd recommend if you have multiple people using your PC, simply select on install for all users so they have access to the Teams as well. We're gonna go continue again. It's gonna ask us to select the installation type. I would recommend selecting both Teams as well as the Teams audio driver. On my computer, I've already got the audio driver already installed, so I'm gonna leave this unticked. But if you're installing this for the first time, I would leave both options here ticked. Next, I'd hit continue. Then it's gonna let you choose where you wanna save it, the installation location. You can change the location if you want, but I would recommend leaving it to the default on your hard drive. But if you wanted to, you could choose to change the installation location and then simply hit install. It's gonna ask you to sign into your computer. It's gonna ask for access to your downloads folder. Simply go okay. Now you're just gonna let it install. It's gonna take a couple of minutes then you're gonna see this option that says installation was successful and Microsoft Teams is gonna open up. From here, if you've already installed Teams on your computer before, it may already know a Microsoft account you wanna sign in with. If you haven't installed it before, you can select down the bottom on use another account or sign up. Simply either log in with an existing account or you can sign up for the first time. I'm gonna select on one of my existing accounts and then Microsoft Teams is gonna load. And there you have it, it is that easy to install Microsoft Teams on your Mac. Of course, if you like this video, let me know by giving it a thumbs up, and if you want to supercharge the ways your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye.